Today, I urge my colleagues to pass the Fairness and Orphan Drug Exclusivity Act, which would close the loophole that blocks pharmaceutical competition and prevents innovative treatments for opioid abu abuse disorders from coming to the market. The opioid crisis in this country, as you know, is very serious, and the COVID-19 pandemic has only exacerbated the problem. Because of the pandemic and all its underlying issues, uh, fear of the virus, increased economic hardship, and the challenges of staying at home and maintaining safe distance, opioid abusers are skyrocketing, and the epidemic has taken a toll on communities in every corner of the country. I'm proud to co-lead this piece of legislation uh, and that our Democratic majority pushed ahead with bringing it to the floor again for a vote uh, amid last week's partisan attempt to hold this legislation hostage. Uh, because fighting the opioid epidemic cannot wait any longer, uh, in the past 20 years we've seen a drastic increase in opioid addiction with nearly every state in the nation seeing a spike in overdose deaths. Uh, and passing our Fairness and Orphan Drug Exclusivity Act will help curb the senseless loss of life by expanding treatment options and driving down costs of new medicines. Madam Speaker, I yield back.